Hey, Pat Cherubini here with the Cherubini Company, and I am going to give you a quick little mini course on our dashboard. Um, if you are a current client or new client, this is something that's going to help you use our dashboard and help you follow up with your leads and just help you understand everything that you can do in there and maybe even give you some ideas of things that you could do now that you're going to watch this. So this is our dashboard. We call her Justine. Uh, there is a reason for that. Uh, we share that video. It is kind of like Siri, but awesome. So it is a little bit of artificial intelligence, a lot of automation, and it's a whole lot going on. So anytime you need to get to it, you should already know this, but go to justine.cherubinicompany.com. Give you, it'll give you the account that we gave to you, sign in and you should be signed into your account. We can make more accounts if you need some extra ones for, say, uh, your front desk or anybody that wants to help. So just let us know. And this is the dashboard. I'm just going to give you a quick walk around in this video. It's going to be an overview of everything that we're looking at, and then we're going to go step-by-step step and go tab-by-tab tab and explain what's there, what, why it's there, and what we can do with it and how to use it. So this is the overall dashboard. The first thing that I want to show you is where you're already looking at now are the training videos. Once this is live, I'm obviously recording it right now. You'll be able to click this. You should have already been there. If you haven't yet, click log in to enroll, and then you can watch everything that we do right here in this little course. And you can always go back and uh, watch it again. You can give it to other people to watch, and it should help you. Second thing is we have a support tab right here at the bottom. Click on that. It'll take you straight to our support. If you have a question or something going on, you can register an account there or just click in as a guest, write a support ticket with your email, and we will get it and we'll be able to get back to you. And it kind of helps us keep things straight. So if you ever have a problem, open a support ticket. If you ever want to learn more, go to training videos, and we're going to keep showing you stuff as this goes. So the Next thing, the way I want to start this off is this is a new tool that we are continuously building and, and making our own. So this is the way it looks right now. It's going to change. Just like Facebook, how we move things around and you learn something and then it changes. Just know that this is going to change. So I'm going to give you the deep overview. Sometimes when this changes, you're just going to have to remember and figure it out or open a ticket and it will help you. So this is what you'll see when you log in all the time. This is the dashboard tab. You can always get back by clicking the dashboard tab. And this is going to keep a running count of your opportunities, which we call leads, opportunities, how many you've got, how many you've closed, all that. The pipeline value, if you keep up on your values on what a lifetime value of one of your clients is, this helps you understand where your marketing dollars are going, what kind of ROI, return on investment you're getting, and then your conversion rate is how many you've actually sold. So no matter what you're selling, whether you're a dentist or a doctor or selling socks to people, you know this is how we keep track of it. So all these blue links here are date choosers. So you can select like the last seven days, click that, click this green check mark, and it'll change everything to how many has come in the last seven days. We've gotten six leads worth a potential of this much money and we haven't closed any yet. So the next level is your funnel. Everybody's funnel can be different. This is just a basic overview. So we have the funnel set up as the top are the new leads coming in. As you can see, there are six. Let me jack that up a little bit so it's a little bit bigger. The next level down in your funnel is people that you're following up with. And then we've got waiting on and then scheduled. So this is this will relate in another video. We'll show you how your pipeline, your pipeline is kind of laid horizontally and the funnel is vertical. So it's it, they relate to the same thing. So the new leads are at the top of your funnel. On your pipeline, the new leads are at the left side. So that's the way the pipeline is. If you go down, you, and you can always look, same thing, you can choose if you have multiple pipelines. Sometimes this will be changed. Most of you will only have one pipeline, and you can see what's going on. You can turn off, click on these, and it'll turn off the ones that aren't relevant. 
So you can just see what's going on, turn them back on by clicking on them. And then the next level are your tasks. You can assign tasks to any opportunity. You can assign them to yourself. You can assign them to somebody else, and it'll show up right here. So once you get here, you can see that there's stuff going on. You can click right to it and then take care of the task. And when you're done, you can check it off. Next level is the lead source report. This tells you where the opportunities and leads that you have in your pipeline, where they came from. When we run ads for you, it's more than likely Facebook ads or Google ads. And we'll put a little tag on there so you'll know that that lead came in from a Facebook ad. If you add a lead yourself, you can put in, you know, where you met that lead. Um, and it, the values, it's all tracked right here. How many are open, one lost, win percentages. Again, you can choose the date that you're looking at this lead report. The next level are your reviews. We're going to show you in another video this little check-in client is a magic button on getting more reviews. We'll show your average rating automatically. Um, how many are positive reviews over the last six months versus negative? How many people in the last six months you've actually invited? And if you have more than one on your team, who's the lead? You can also click on these three dots at any time and it'll choose different um, time frames. So that is the dashboard. Of course, you can go up here, click on your picture to sign out. This is a pretty important button here. That's your most recent activity. So this is just a test, a demo account, but it'll show you who has commented or asked a question and you want to keep up with this. This is tied to this conversations tab, which will be the next video that we're going to talk about. But you can always click right here, see what's going on. There's your recent activity. You can click straight onto it and go where you need to go. Don't worry about that yet. We'll go back to that. So, and then this is if you want to use Justine as a soft phone, they call it, we can literally make phone calls straight from here by clicking this button. Who you want to call, you click on who you want to call, and you can literally just call right from here. So that'll all come later. As of now, that is the end of this overview, and I will send us over to the next video, which is going to be about the conversations tab. So again, as a reminder, support tab. If you ever, ever have any questions, you can get a hold of everybody there and I'll see you in the next video.